start. Yeah. Uh, what's that feel like? And you kind of prepared for that? Yeah, I mean, it's exciting. I was, you know, working at it towards the end of the season last year, just, you know, just kind of a contingency thing, just in case. And, you know, just tells me that coach trusts me at the position. So, just gonna get really good experience out of this spring. An opportunity to, I guess, get more experience doing that now that Jake's out. And has it kind of been tough seeing him kind of sidelined like that in a different? Yeah, yeah, it's just weird because especially a guy that came in with me at the same time last year or you know a few years ago. So, but you know he's killing rehab and everything. So. It's going to be excited when he gets back, and but until then, just going to do what we can without him. Do you feel like this is an advantage, or is this possibly delaying any development you would have at another position that you'll probably play no, at? I mean, this is something I've always wanted. I've wanted to be able to work at every position, and this is a great opportunity to do that. So I'm, I'm just excited. I think it's going to be great. What do you think is your best position, what, or which one do you like the most? Probably just right tackle. I mean, I've spent the most time there, probably the most comfortable, I would say, there, just because the amount of experience I've had at the position. So. I would say right tackle probably. How about snapping the ball? Is that a difficult part of the game for you yet? Or, or? No, I've worked at it a lot, so I'm, I'm, I'm comfortable at it. I'm not worried about it. Could you have been plugged into a game last year? I felt like you could have gotten Crispo by. wanted to one yeah. game at the very end. Just to give it a shot. Just, but the time ran out with the other team had the ball, so. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so you were you were sharp enough, at least, that, yeah. that you guys Absolutely, felt like yeah, you I felt good at it. Yeah. yeah. Obviously, with you not playing at right tackle, we've got... George Moore filling in on the depth chart there. What have you kind of seen from him, and are you confident he can kind of fill in with, with the offense? Yeah, I mean, he's made really good strides in this offseason. He's been working hard in the weight room, been you know, trying to get into his playbook, which is good. So I'm excited to see what he can do today. Physically, obviously, he's a specimen. What is he as a technique guy? I mean, has he developed there? I mean, what, what kind of you seen? Yeah, absolutely. Broadway? I mean, he's definitely made strides in that area, and he's been working really hard at trying to really you know, tighten down that technique and kind of make his movements more efficient, which is good. So, yeah, be good to see what he can do. What, what have you kind of seen from Coach Mirabal? I know he'll be coaching you at least in, with the interior guys yeah. for a little bit, and you'll probably move back out with Coach Mirabal at the end. But, I mean, Quinn, what have you experienced from him and what kind of guy is he? He's, you know, he's a fiery little guy, and he, you know, he, he loves to work hard, and he pushes us. And his biggest thing is just really kind of setting a standard for the rest of the team that we all, you know, want to abide by. And, kind of strengthen and just keep pushing. He says a little guy, you know, he's quite a bit shorter than the guys he's coaching. Is that kind of a weird dynamic looking down at the guy who's giving you instruction? Or no, it, I, it's awesome. He's a great guy and I'm excited to see him on the field. How have you seen Coach Cristobal change going from obviously a position coach to a head coaching position and kind of are you encouraged by kind of what you've seen from him? Yeah, I mean, I, he just has, you know, more responsibilities now and but he's, you know, taking them in stride and he's been doing an awesome job at that. and. It's cool to see kind of that side of him versus the you know the O-line coach side of him, which is, but it's nice that he still you know will work with the O-line when he can. But yeah, it's good. You said that side of him. What, what particular are you talking about that you kind of see different come out of him? Uh, I would just say more of that little bit administration side, more of the you know, big picture side versus kind of working with just one position. That's kind of yeah. Thank you. Right. Thanks, Cal. Thanks, guys.